Hey everyone, I am Kim. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel today. It is day 7 of my 14 days of love series. We are halfway there. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how I was able to create this set right here. I did it using my Cartoon new nail pump ups. So if you want to see how I did it, then keep on watching. So I got these as part of McCart's whole Hooked on Love Valentine's Day collection, but you can buy them by themselves. I believe that they cost $12.99 by themselves, which I think is a pretty good price because the length um, the length is pretty long. These are, these are like double XL, which I think is amazing. Uh, they give you two different colors, so you get some choices. They also give you um, in the kit a thank you note, an alcohol pad, a small orange stick, they give you some McCart nail glue. They also give you a small 100, 180 grit nail file. I thought this was so cute. Look at it compared to the normal size. It's like a mommy one and a baby one. Uh, so I think that the price of $13 is pretty fair for everything you get in the kit and all the things that you could do with it. Uh, so I'm starting off by sizing. I chose to just use this more darker pink color and when it comes to sizing there's not really much to it you just want to make sure that the tip is covering your natural nail completely and by that i mean you don't see any little sliver of your natural nail coming out the sides or anything like that it should be seamless looking like this is like your natural nail um coming out <laughs> like growing out from your hand you know and something else about sizing, you want the tip to cover your natural nail comfortably. Like if you have to push down for the tip to cover your natural nail completely, then that tip is not going to end up being comfortable to you when you end up gluing it down. So if we are following the instructions, the first one says file the sides and cuticles of your natural nails for proper fitting. I'm not going to file my cuticles because I already saw that the nails are going to fit me really well, so we're going to skip that. Also, that's kind of starting prep, and you guys know we're skipping prep this whole series. Then it says, clean your natural nails with rubbing alcohol. That's also prep. I'm not going to do that. Then it says, apply nail glue to the underside of the nail pump ups. So that is where we are going to start. Right now, on my natural nails, I have like lotion and cuticle oil which I put on for the video and I'm going to leave on again because we're skipping prep and that is going to help me uh, be able to take these off quickly especially messing with nail glue. It's not the same as in a prey dupe you know this nail glue this and I mean in general nail glue is really abrasive so I need all the help I can get you know so. Anyways, like I said, we're starting there. I put a tiny bit of that nail glue into that tip, press it up against my cuticle, and then just press down. I fast forwarded this a little bit, but I basically pressed down for about 20 seconds, and this is what the nail looks like. And I actually love this glue because I had a tiny bit of seepage, but it's not the kind of glue that um, dries white and I love that with nail glue because any little you know mess or mishap that you have it's not you know magnifying it times 10. So once again I'm just placing a little bit of glue around the area that's going to cover my natural nail. I press it up against my cuticle make sure that it's straight because that's something with me and press-ons like I swear they're straight and then once they're glue they're not and that is a huge pet peeve of mine especially when i go to take pictures after um but yeah make sure they're straight and press them down that's all there is to it this was so easy it literally took me five minutes so after that i'm gonna go in with some mccart holographic top coat i love this top coat like i use it i've used it in so many other videos but basically anytime i want to add a little bit of glitter uh, I pull this baby out so that is what I wanted to do here I wanted to make it you know really cute and glittery and also I wanted to get rid of their matte top coat I I wanted these specific nails to be glossy but I do like the fact that they come matte so while I polish let's go over uh, a few things that McCart says on the back of their box they say that these are a new line of colored acrylic false nails so that makes sense because when I felt the acrylic they um excuse me when I felt the nails they did feel stronger than your average press on uh, so that makes sense 
they say that they are e made out of eco-friendly material they uh, are non-toxic they can last up to 30 days with proper care and application and that also that you could shape the nail to any desired length so that is just a few things that McCart says about that so once I'm done with polishing, I'm ready to move on to the bling. You guys saw the main focal point of this set is that ring. So for the rest of the nails, I'm just going to do one little stone there at the end. These I actually got in the McCart Pink Poly Gel Kit. So it's crazy almost everything I'm using today is from McCart. Uh, and to adhere the stones on, I'm using McCart's Gem Glue. So I just put a tiny bit right where I wanted it and then press that stone in. And I'm doing that to all the rest of the nails except the one that's going to get the ring. So once I'm done with the small stones, I'm ready for the ring and this is a Swarovski ring that I got from Daily Charm. So I just took some of that gem glue, put a bit right in the middle of my nail. I say a bit but you want to put more than you did for those smaller gems and then I put the ring through as if I'm proposing to myself and I lean it into that gel. Then I'm going to slowly approach my light and it would have been so much better if I had my mini lamp out uh, because then I wouldn't, you know, I would have had more space for my hands, but it's okay. It still luckily came out centered, so it all worked out. Once I'm done with that, I like to go over all my stones with some alcohol just so that they shine and then I go in with some cuticle oil. And here is the finished product. What do you guys think? Wasn't this short, sweet, and to the point? This is actually why I love these McCart pump ups. There's so much that you can do, so many ways that you can customize them, and it really doesn't take long at all. You guys saw to do this side only took me like five minutes. So imagine just both hands, it would just only take like 10, 15 minutes. Uh, but I absolutely love how this set came out. This is like valentine's day when you want to drop a hint but you don't but you want to be subtle but kind of not really <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed watching me make this set i hope you guys are enjoying this series as always my name is kim i love you so much and i will see you on day eight bye <laughs>